Look in Bentonville from our Jack Link's eye cam down in Fort Smith. Not a cloud in the sky here. Just a few stray ones there in the upper right hand corner of your screen. Let's check in with Matt now as we talk about this gorgeous fall day that feels a bit more like late summer. Yeah, I, we do get a little bit warm on some of these afternoons, but with the humidity just gone, it doesn't feel all that bad. This evening, northwest Arkansas, we'll quickly dip into the 60s. Uh, we're in the 70s now, about mid-70s, 66 by 7 o'clock. And then, of course, once we get closer to 10 o'clock, I think we'll be back into the 50s. We may not be as cool tonight as we were last night, though certainly winds are, are strengthening as our next system approaches. We've got a, maybe a couple of rain chances tomorrow. We're watching the system out towards the west, and it's not a big deal. What's going on this week is we have a bunch of high pressure just throughout the central United States. So any system that tries to squeeze on through, really struggles. I don't think we're going to be able to break this type of pattern until we really get towards next week. Then we have better chances to get more fronts coming on through, but this week's pretty quiet. In the River Valley, we'll drop eventually to the 60s by about 8 o'clock this evening. There's that system that we're talking about. This will be arriving for Wednesday. The center of low pressure where most of the action takes place is actually going to be moving kind of more towards the north and east, towards the Great Lakes. This cold front's going to kind of dangle south and just kind of sweep past us, maybe dropping temperatures by 5 to 10 degrees for the next couple of days. So it's not a huge front headed our way. And that means we could maybe get a stray shower or two, but we're not talking about severe weather. That's some good news, but maybe a couple of raindrops tomorrow. Right now, no raindrops out there. We're, we're good the rest of the evening. We're good overnight. We're even good headed out tomorrow morning taking the kids to school tomorrow. I'm not going to worry about any weather. There may be a few more clouds, but then but the rain will probably hold off later into the afternoon. Temperatures tomorrow morning we will start in the 50s. Remember, uh, this morning we started into the low to mid 40s, so we'll probably be a little bit warmer starting for your Wednesday and then warming up to the mid 70s. Rain chances probably won't start though a little bit later into the afternoon. We'll get more of those clouds and maybe a couple of raindrops here and there, but that's going to be about it. In the River Valley, we may briefly try to hit 80. Right now we're sitting in the upper 70s. Poto and and Torsalis, we're at 79. We're close, but I think a better chance for hitting those 80s will take place tomorrow afternoon as eventually some more of those clouds start to move on through. Here's your rain timeline talking about Wednesday. First half of the day, I think we're fine. The second half, we have that 20% chance. I mean, we're talking about low rain chances here. I'm not even sure if everyone's going to get the rain. This is another way to look at some of the rain. As that system moves northbound, heavy bands towards our north. And notice here in the south, we're just barely clipped. We got a 20% chance. Higher rain chances lie off towards the north in Missouri. So a few more clouds come in tomorrow, maybe a couple of raindrops. That's going to be about it. And then dry weather for the rest of the week. Here's a look at Futurecast. One more way to kind of watch this as we get that next system coming in. Mainly clear skies tonight. Eventually that front starts to approach a little bit later into the day. And then we'll have more of those rain chances starting to move on through. A couple of raindrops here and there, but not everyone's going to get one. So we'll be watching that closely for you guys drive by by Thursday. In fact, I think we'll be sunny for Thursday and mostly sunny Friday. This weekend, another system very similar to what we're going to get Wednesday will start to move on through and that could also have a couple rain chances for us. Not talking about a washout, so that's some good news. Some of us may even stay completely dry this weekend. I think if you had to pick one day though, Eric and Darren, for that rain chance this weekend, maybe Sunday, but otherwise, rain chances look low the next seven days. What's this upper 80s nonsense next week? <laughs> I know. My gosh. <sighs> But we were done with I all know. That. <laughs> hey, I mean, hopefully we're done with the 90s, though. Yeah. We've got to take each range. I was going to say, one. today felt kind of late summery. That's going to feel more like midsummer. Yeah. So. yeah, it does. All right, Matt. Well, thanks. The seventh annual give.